Hello, and welcome to the Analyst Corner offered by One One Blockchains. I am Enrico Camerinelli, VP of Research. The topic of discussion is blockchain in pharma. The pharmaceutical industry is a 482 billion industry. When we speak of the pharma pharmaceutical sector, we must think of three main processes, discovery, development, and distribution. <clears throat> to get a better understanding of the pharma industry, let's first take a quick look at some of its most relevant challenges. Generic drugs increase competition. This means that low cost generic drugs have a preferential release policy to the market. This makes it hard for new drugs to get approved. Another issue is the so-called pharma data disparity. Data is stored in silos and generates data disparity. With data, pharma companies experiment, understand and innovate new drugs. The dependence on different sources and the inability to verify the uploaded and shared data makes data disparity a real problem to the pharma industry. Data disparity is also caused by the difference of data structures and models. Time consuming is where we refer to data analysis. Data accessed from different sources that use different models and structures make data analytics very time consuming and resource heavy. Supply chain is not efficient. With compromised supply chains, the pharma company loses almost $200 billion every year due to fraud and counterfeit drugs. And stagnation, pharma companies still are relying on traditional practices, while almost every other industry has changed in terms of management, culture, and processes. So what is the role of blockchain? But well, blockchain can modernize the pharma industry as it introduces three important elements, privacy, transparency, and traceability. This will help with the industry's laws, practices, privacy, and global regulations. Clinical trials will benefit from the access to more transparent and correct information. The decentralized nature of blockchain lets the critical clinical labs use a transparent, immutable data source where it is not possible to hamper the data. The clinical trial data can be stored in a public blockchain where data can be accessed whenever needed. It is tamper-proof and the clinical labs can completely trust the data to carry out the results of their trials. Blockchain is equally useful for adding governance and compliance to the supply chain. Immutability, blockchain's distributed nature, and transparency are applied to pharma discovery, development, and distribution processes. So in conclusion, the current pharmaceutical industry is patient-centric. Blockchain can not only help through the discovery, development, and distribution processes, but also facilitate the process of connecting pharma companies between themselves and to the patient, who remains in control of his or her own personal data. Pharma companies are joining forces to leverage the strengths of sharing data on a decentralized, distributed, and immutable data structure. The MediLedger project, for instance, is an open and decentralized network for the pharmaceutical supply chain. Humana, Multiplan, Quest Diagnostic, Optum, and United Healthcare launched a program applying blockchain technology to improve data quality and reduce administrative costs associated with changes to healthcare provider demographic data. So this concludes the analyst corner offered to you by 101 Blockchains. I am Enrico Camerinelli, VP of Research.